What's up, what's up? Welcome back to the Black Top Goat Classic. You're about to watch game two of the Smokers Cup. That's right. Game one, we had Chef Curry versus James Worthy's top fives in which Michael Jordan took over the court for Team Curry, pushing Team Curry to the second round. Michael got so busy. Now we're dealing with the bottom half of the bracket. We got Melo versus Penny today. On Penny's side, we got Giannis, Tatum, Zion, Ja, and Big Ben. Carmelo. We got KG, KD, Melo himself, Kobe, and Kyrie. A lot of K's over there. Okay. Let's see how this one go. Uh, I'm excited to see all the young talent in this game. Big Ben scores over KD. Like Big Ben, Ben Simmons, uh, Penny's whole squad. Uh, KD with the putback. KG, my mistake, with the, with the putback after Giannis blocks. Yeah, so... Penny's team, uh, of course, all the teams that are, that are playing as Ja hits the deuce are formed off the All The Smoke podcast with Matt and Stack. Shouts out to them. Be sure to like and subscribe there to subscribe to their channel. Uh, Penny's team with the young gunners on here with the new kind of like the goat like individuals in the NBA uh, it was basically like uh, Matt asked him who he liked in the NBA right now and I took that team and formed it pretty awesome team if you look at it you know nice young awesome team Giannis with the mismatch down low takes advantage of Kyrie to push team Penny up by three Penny Hardaway, of course, long time, I think 13 year NBA vet. His most prominent years is when he came in with the Orlando Magic. Uh, he definitely was one of my favorite players during that time. I mean, the impact that he had, Little Penny, his sneakers and everything. Oh, Ja with the layup after going behind the back to cut between two defenders. Great move, Ja. Penny Hardaway, Shaq made sure Penny came over to the Magic after filming the blue chips with him. Uh, they wind up going to the finals. Wow. Did y'all just see Kyrie bake Ja like that? <laughs> Yo, Kyrie just big job. 5-4, Team Penny up. But yeah, uh, that Shaq and Penny team, they defeated, uh, if I remember right, they defeated Jordan's Bulls when Jordan came back from retirement. I think he beat them in the first round. I think they beat them in the first or second round. KG with the dunk over Giannis, showing a young boy what he do. Only at the blacktop, baby. But yeah, uh, Shaq and Penny, they got swept and Hakeem won his first championship over them. But uh, if it wasn't for the injuries, I think that uh, Penny Hardaway would have been definitely one of the GOATs of the NBA. He's already revered as a very great player in his time. Um, I, I think he definitely would have been seeing many finals runs. Actually, he could have been a champion as well. But as good as he played, Giannis post up Carmelo, then dunks over him. Man. 
Greek freak putting on in the black top. 6 5, Team Penny. KD ties it up for Team Melo. Carmelo Anthony, Red Hook Brooklyn representative. Played a very illustrious career. One of the most prolific scorers of our time. Definitely a beast. I think, I think that he's still, like he's one of the top scorers in Olympic history. Uh, he's definitely top 10 scorer all time. I think he's number nine on the all time scorers. Giannis found JT in the corner. JT for three. Eight sixteen penny. Great career, uh, Carmelo Anthony. One thing I wish about Melo, I, I, I wish that uh, he would have made the move to Miami with LeBron and Wade. I think that would have been more of a championship tandem. I think even though Bosh, great, awesome, uh, Chris Bosh also team, uh, Chris Bosh's team also is in this tournament. Uh, I, I definitely think that um, Melo, a prime Melo with prime Braun and and Wade, you know that that would have been an instant championship, instantly. They they would have they would have handled uh, the Mavericks pretty good. It have handled them. Kyrie hits the tough shot in the corner. Keeping Team Melo alive. What's interesting about Melo's team in this tournament is that in the episode of All the Smoke, Giannis is schooling everybody. Took KG straight to the rim to take the lead for Team Penny. But like I said, what's interesting about uh, Melo's team is that his team. I think it was Stacker Matt who asked him, like, who would he bring to the black top? Ooh. As Melo does what he does, can't leave him open. Takes the lead for his team, 10-9. But he was asked if who would he bring to the black top, and he picked these guys specifically, and they're putting on right now. They're showing up right now as they have the lead. Definitely Kyrie belongs there, right? Wow, as JT hits the long deuce, taking the lead back for Team Penny. Right? Carmelo. Oh, JT blocks Melo down low. Oh, no alley for you, Zion. That'd have been Liddy, though. Kyrie ties it up. Uncle Drew out there. Keeping Team Melo in, in the game. Yo, to speak on Kyrie Irving's movie Uncle Drew and that character, uh, I think it was completely genius. Oh, Melo fouls JT. I think Uncle Drew, the whole Uncle Drew thing is completely genius. And I think I think it has a good argument as far as like greatest basketball movie of all time. Right? There are a lot of great basketball movies. Uh Coach Carter, Space Jam, both the Space Jams. Uh, the Six Man, love the Six Man, love Marlon Wayans and the Six Man. Melo hits the tough shot over JT, showing the young bull that he got it on the black top. This is what he do. Slowed it down for the animations. The animations are awesome. I'll get back to that in a moment. But yeah, Uncle Drew, as Giannis lays up 
to tie the score 12-12 for Penny. Uncle Drew is definitely one of my favorite movies all time. And definitely, I think it is uh, number two to Space Jam. And I'm going to say to Michael Jordan, Space Jam, right? And I'm and I'm only being politically correct with the Michael Jordan Space Jam. I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to leave it right there, cause the goats, the <laughs> goat Space Jam wasn't too bad either. JT steps out, turns the ball over. Team Melo getting the ball. Giannis check ball. But what do you guys think? Is Uncle Drew number two or number one? When we're talking about greatest basketball movies of all time. Melo. Ooh. Melo doing what he do out there. Takes the lead, 13-12. We got a great one here, folks. But yeah, what do y'all think? What do y'all think about Uncle Drew? Is it number two or number one? Greatest basketball movie of all time. Shouts out to Kyrie and that whole cast. Shaq did well. Chris Webber. Oh my gosh. His big ass face, yo. <laughs> yo. When he looked at Shorty, <laughs> uh, uh, that was playing, when uh, that was playing uh, Nate Robinson's granddaughter. I forget her name right now. Please forgive me if you remember her name. I think she's a ball player too for the WNBA. Throw her name in the comments. But when he looked at her, like to the side, like, like yo, I th yo, I'd have died. Yo, get your big ass face out mine, man. <laughs> KD. I mean, KG, a lot of K's, man, but, man, is KG schooling Giannis right now. Team Melo taking charge. KD pushes Team Melo up by two with a dunk over Freak. Let's get it. This song, this, you only get this at the blacktop, baby. Welcome to the blacktop. Yo, 2K, shout out to 2K, 2K24, best 2K ever made. The animations are too real. Oh my gosh. KD getting bullied down there. Ja caught one on you, boy, at the blacktop. It's only right Ja had to catch one, right? It's only right. Yo, man, this is a fucking, oh my gosh. They wildin' out there, man. Kyrie sees KG for the oop, yo. This is a dunk fest out here. KG point game for Melo for the oop. It's crazy. Wow. Giannis got KG in the air. But look, the animations in 2K24 has stepped up tremendously. The game is a lot faster while, while maintaining its visual integrity. Wow, Kyrie, miss, Kyrie misses a layup. Easy layup, too. Oh, oh my God! Freak, why did you do it to him? Yo, KD, you getting bullied on the blacktop right now, man. What's going on? Game is extended now. Freak wasn't going out like that. Kyrie misses an open deuce that would have ended the game. Freak, wide open dunk. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Giannis is tearing up the black top right now. He brought Team Penny back. What? Yo, he's going in right now. This is a great game, y'all. If this is your first time seeing a black top go classic, this is what it's about, baby. Pure, unadulter unadulterated ballerism at its best. The black top. Ja, wide open. Fakes KG. Uh-oh, Giannis. Giannis got Kyrie down low. That's not a good look for 
for Team Melo. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. And they pass it to him. Up, oh, it's over. All over. He can't stop it. Giannis. Look. Much respect. I love it. That's why I love 2K20. Look what look at that right there. Giannis takes home the game. He is obviously the king of the streets. Brought Team Penny back. He was dunking on everything. His defense was there. He was just being a bully down low. Great game, Giannis. Keeping Team Penny in it. Team Penny moving to the next round, y'all. Where he's going to wait. Whoever wins out of Chauncey Billups or Chris Bosh. If you like the tournament, go to our About section. Hit the Goat Like TV email list link. Join our email list. And drop your top five because we got a tournament we're starting. And your top five can be featured in it. Live gaming tournament. With that being said, peace.